Greetings, Mac Warriors. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is TTB speaking, and welcome back to BattleTech. This time, Urban Warfare, ladies and gentlemen. Yep, the Aaron has finally landed. We've got new maps, we've got new game modes, we've got two new mechs, the Raven and the Javelin, and some new tech, including ECM. So, uh, that's gonna be interesting to see. Now, I wanted to go to Itram next, but I saw these two missions, and I'm like, yeah, you know what? I at least want to try one of them, and it's only 15 days to travel to Ryan's Fate, so I'm gonna try one of them and see how it goes. So let's get our asses up on over there. Uh, that will nicely coincide with our repair time on our mechs here, so everything should be hunky-dory. At least that's my plan. But that's a report is coming up. What? Carlisle's bid. The Great Death Legion wants to poach Behemoth? Nah, 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 nah. Um, don't make a quick decision. No lasting com consequences. Okay, good. Behemoths will stick around. Good. I mean, it, it's okay. Um, I, I've, I've actually read that you can lose a, a mech warrior like this if you give the wrong answer, which is kind of funny. It's like, yeah, you're your most experienced guy and just, <laughs> bye. I'm out of here. See ya. Uh, that would have been bad. That would have been insanely bad. Okay, so we should be at Ryan's fate. Uh, we can also check the uh, shop over there. Financial, Financial report is looking good. We've got some nice cash in here. Things are looking good. Uh, by the way, what about ship upgrades? What can we do? We can build a... what do we have here? That requires gamma port for morale. It also requires gamma port for morale. Yeah, so let's go ahead and... Well, drive system would also be interesting, but nah. Okay, let's get Gamma Pot first. Whoop, that is not Gamma, that's Beta. Here we go, Gamma Pot. 2.25 million. Okay, sure. 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 Done. And upgrade in progress. Very nice. Okay. Continue to Ryan's fate. Alright, our mechs are ready. Banshee is ready, the Highlander is ready, the Battlemaster is ready, and the Onion is ready. Perfect. I would love to get a Stalker or a Cyclops. Cyclops specifically, because with the Cyclops you can you can do something extremely neat, where you go ahead and... Um, the Cyclops, there's a Cyclops version that has a command console, or something like that, in the cockpit. And what that does, it raises the initiative of all mechs by one. It's insane. Alright, uh, let's see what the store has to offer. Griffin parts. Medium laser double plus. Yep, we'll buy that. New weapon um, and nothing else. Okay, well. Let's get on with our contract then. Let's see what else is available here on this system, by the way. Maybe we can get one of the new missions as well. Holy hell, there's stuff going on here. Destroy base, recovery, three-star battle, heart of darkness, three-star assassination. Okay, and then this this four star battle here. Wow. Okay. Well, let's get on with our contract. Launch in Z. Everything looking good. Let's deploy. I really have no idea what to expect here. Could be crazy. I hope we don't get demolishers again. I really, really hate demolishers. We might catch them with their metaphorical pants down. Hmm. Interested. It says a heavy lance. One lance. We can deal with that. Three and a half skulls should not be a problem. Command interface initiated. Oh. That's a lot of dust. Okay. Martian environment. Alrighty, boys. Here we go. Let's rush to these fools and rush them, rush them out and flush them out. Uh, where are they? Over there, okay. Uh, I don't want to be approaching from this side, I feel, because there's too much rubble around. So we'll approach from this side. And that way, hopefully be a little bit more protected. Enemy contact. 65 tons. Mm -hmm. Alright, Decker, what can you do? We could just move Decker over yonder. And then we can go ahead and sensor lock one gentleman here. Thunderbolt. Alright. 
and then Glitch can move up a little bit, like so. And we start the rain. <laughs> That's looking quite nicely. Coming closer though. Oh, he's in rough terrain now. I should have maybe waited even to, to let him walk into rough terrain and then shoot him. Alright. What else do we have? 60 tons. Okay, this might just be a heavy land, in which case this will be a quick one. Uh-huh. That was a big missile launcher, though. Okay. Um, a behemoth. Can you get in range? She can. Well, in that case, fire some stuff. Mm-hmm. And then TTB, can you get in range? No. But what you can do is sprint like a madman. I like these new little icons. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, that came from the right. Okay, they got reinforcements. Well, that sounds fair. Um, that's not good. Especially since they apparently, for some reason, always have 10,000 lerms. Which makes this game insanely unfair. <laughs> what is that? I didn't see it even. And more lerms! Yay! What, what the hell is a stray shot? Okay. Apparently there's some new stuff in the game. Interesting. Alright. Let's, uh, let's try and do something with these guys, right? Um, so that Thunderbolt, for example, I don't like him. I think he needs to go away. Firing. Yep, just like that. Enemy down. I've been sent to Not good. What can, I do for you? Um, what can we do here? Hmm. I can move Glitch over here. Let's start learning that quick draw. Just to get his evasive pips down a little bit. Okay, yeah, that's quite a bit coming from this side. Quite a bit coming from this side. Okay, I need to be careful about my battle master because the arm is already heavily damaged. And quick draw is an ace pilot. Alright. Oh, that's an Orion. AC10. Okay. Yeah, I think I need to I need to push uh, pull back Decker a little bit here. It's too far up. Get TTB in the fight here. And uh, get rid of that quick draw. Ripperoni Jabroni! Hmm, actually, we didn't get rid of him. We just opened him up big time. I mean, it's not bad, but. That's alright. We got Behemoth. Luckily, we got Behemoth, so Behemoth. Um, it's gonna be a little bit toasty, but would you do the, the honors of potentially killing this guy? Yep, beautiful. Alrighty. Two guys down on the mainlands. But there's still three on the side here, maybe four. And of course they've got all the lerms in the freaking world, it's so annoying. I wish I could drop two lances. Because they all got they all got a giant um hard on for the sensor lock next. Of course. Uh-huh. Oh catapult. Interesting. I need to pull back the battlemaster. Armor breach. Internal damage. Which is really hard to do. Um, let me move him here. Because I need I need him in the fight, that's the problem. Um, I can shoot the catapult, but not with all the weapons. Let's do it like that, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I should have turned the mech further. That was a mistake. Oh, at least Glitch is getting hammered. And of course, hit it, yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's a hell Whoa! 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 Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Um, yep. Uh, we are going over here. And we're hammering the catapult, and we're hammering the catapult down. Hopefully. Nope, just unsteady. Because we weren't at the threshold for like one teensy bit thingy. That's annoying. Okay, fires on Behemoth is great. I need to get Behemoth closer so I can melee because uh, she's just too hot right now. Um, TTB needs to cool down as well. Let's see what we can do with, with Behemoth here. Let's move her here. We can go cool and vent. And the next round we melee. And we go on to the catapult. Um, hmm. Yep, we fire everything. 
Mm, no damage. Okay. Let's get TTB over here. And you can go ahead and murder said catapult. They, he shouldn't survive that. Oh, he did survive it, but he's not. his mech is non-existent anymore. <laughs> also knocked down. Alright. Alright, we're all inspired. These guys are far away. Unfortunately, they can still see us, but Behemoth is taking some fire now. That's okay. I need to work on that Highlander. I want that Highlander. I want that Highlander. I'm 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 already prepping TTB to just sprint in and shoot this guy in the face. I want that Highlander, guys. Uh, what? What do you mean? Okay. Um, Decker. Uh, let's pull you like so, and then let's put on coup de gras on this dude. But not with all these weapons. That should be fine. Rip. Good shot. Okay, still an onion left. No, don't sensor lock this guy. Uh, yeah, I really, I really want ECM. <laughs> I really want ECM, my dudes. Okay, glitch. Um, yeah, we're gonna go cool and vent with glitch here. I'm gonna fire everything into this guy. That shook him up quite nicely, but not enough to get to the threshold. It is annoying. That's the Highlander. We're gonna have some Highlander on Highlander violence very soon. But I need to finish this guy first. Ooh, whoa! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Who got a head hit here? Who just got hit in the head? What? Okay, the Banshee. Alright. So, um, the Banshee can melee. Which is exactly what we'll do here, because otherwise we're gonna get too hot. So let's go ahead and hit him in the face! Or somewhere else. And small lasers. <laughs> okay, and then TTB. Um, yeah, I, I need to conserve heat, so we'll also melee him. And a bonk! <laughs> Everything goes to the legs of this poor dude. It's not enough though, but he gets knocked down, that's good, that's perfect. Because that means we can now destroy legs. And the enemy doesn't see us anymore. Unless the sensor lock me. What? Oh, sure. He's just knocked down. Never mind. I'm I'm speaking in tongues. Uh, I misspoke. Uh-oh. Not good. Not good. Not to the rear. Ay -ay -ay -ay. Okay. Okay. We're still hunky dory. Alright. Decker. Um, would, you, would you do the honors of... Um, actually, can we stomp this guy? Yeah, we can stomp him, so let's just stomp him. Big stumpy robots! One leg is gone. Mm, coming closer. Ah, oh, Decker sensor locked once again. <laughs> okay, um... We're just gonna go Lurm Volley on the other leg here. It should be enough Lurms to kill him, hopefully. If it all hits. Nope! It did not hit the leg. Sufficiently. Ah, oh, come on, dudes. Nine damage on the leg missing. Let's see if we can get people killed. Okay, um... How can we engage these guys best? I would say from here, so let's maybe move... Sprint, TTB. A good spot. Like so. This guy, of course, gets to stand up and then melee one of my guys. Potentially killing the cockpit because lol RNG. Let's see. <laughs> I would have been so angry. I'm showing minor damage. Okay, Behemoth, can you please um, can you please take this guy out like for for good now? Because he's getting annoying. What's <laughs> also destroyed? Come on, one leg on the hit, uh, one hit on the leg. That's all you need. Oh, he just gets knocked down again. He might be dead now though. Oh, knocked out. Hallelujah. This guy took a lot of punishment. Okay, there's a 50 tonner, there's a 50 tonner, where's the... There's a 90 tonner, okay, there's a 65, alright. So, Decker. we we'll move Decker here. And we will sensor lock this gentleman over here. Centurion. 
Stop locking me for crying out loud. Uh, we can move Glitch over here. And we start learning the Centurion. Need to watch my heat on Glitch though. Oh, he's unsteady. Very nice. Oh, Jäger mech. With Lerm 15s. Alright. That is annoying. That's insanely annoying. Why do these guys have so many good mechs? Okay. Um, Behemoth. What can we do with Behemoth? Can we just... Is this a smart move to Sprinter somewhere here? Maybe. But where? Why don't they have line of sight on her as much? This spot, maybe. Let's sprint Behemoth over here. Give her time to cool down. TTB has cooled down. Um, the question is... Can he murder this guy from here? 17% chance. Called shot to the head. <laughs> I don't think he can hit it from here. Nope, he can't hit it from here. That's unfortunate. That was a mistake, because now I've got the heat up and everything. I need to wait for the Hydra to turn around. Also, that Jäger mech is annoying. It also needs to go. They all need to go, and they don't have any more armor to do so. Uh, let's get Glitch up front. Even. Like so. And uh, we will hammer down the Highlander. But not like that. Also not like that. Let's check him enough. Yep. Fall on your ass. Bonk. Lots of lerms on the bench. Holy hell. That Centurion... Uh, it's not that dangerous, but it's still a, it's still an annoying mech. Um, can we get Decker to a spot where you can hit this guy? Maybe from here. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Ah, well, it's not ideal, but it's whatever. Ah, we got a hit on the leg. That's good. And it will stand up. Please move to a spot where I can hit you in the face. That looks better. And missing the shot is even better. Okay. TTB round two. Easy on the armor, buddy. <laughs> TTB round two. Gonna go here. No. Here. Here. No. 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 Radiation field. Hmm. No. Okay. Let's go here. What is it right side or left side? That is right torso, so I will have to shield like so. Cool invent. Precision strike once again. I want that Highlander. Why, TTB? Why of all days are you not hitting shit right now? <sighs> okay. Get Behemoth in there. Um, ouchie, that's a little bit toasty. That looks better. <laughs> that guy just got mauled. Very nice. I need to hit his head. Why is it so hard to hit this guy's head? I got one, one or two more chances, but I need to be very careful. I need to probably um, stop using the SRMs. Why is it so hard to get gift me a Highlander? I just want a Highlander, just a teensy, a teensy Highlander. It's all I ever wanted. Okay, Decker, what can you do? Oh, I know what Decker can do. Uh, Decker can go over here. And you can murder the Centurion if you ace 20. Yep. That's one problem gone. One less target. Very hot battle master, by the way. Oh, oh, he comes closer. Even better. Yeah, nothing internal. Ah, Banshee's still holding. All right, boys. Commander? It's almost time. But for now, let's bring some pain into this Lurm boat. Do we have stability damage? 
Ага. Окей. That's shooting quite nicely. <laughs> He's going away to learn the Banshee. Uh oh, shit! Uh oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is really not looking good. Um, TTB, you're up. You go into his face and you take your goddamn AC twenties. What shutdown alert? Like this, maybe? Okay, no shutdown. And please, just hit one into his face. He destroys the leg. Sure. Aim for face, hit leg. Bull crap. Bull crap. Game. Bull crap. <sighs> Sometimes this game is really annoying. Okay, uh, Behemoth is open on the right side. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna sprint her away. And shield with left. Like, uh. Not like so, like so maybe. Here. That's better. Roger, full speed. Okay. Okay. Internal structure damage. So, we've got Decker, we've got Glitch. Got this asshole down here. I mean, I could try shooting away his legs, I guess. Affirmative. Since we already killed one. But uh, I'm having some heat issues here. I mean, it could work. Let's see what happens. Copy that. Nope! You shoot the leg, you go for side torso. Like, are these guys all freaking drunk or what's going on here? Like, what? what is their problem? Normally they hit all the shots and not this time. No, 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 no. I, I got an idea. I got an idea, boss. This time, let's not hit shit. And he's standing up. I don't know if you even get full salvage for him now. I'm taking internal damage. Yeah, I get that. Oh, overheat alert even. I can only shoot one AC-20. It's not enough to kill the leg. But it is enough to kill the head. Let's try once more. Actually, but not from this angle. Oh no, it's direct. It's direct angle. Never mind. Well then, TTB. Can you freaking aim? Engaging target. Nope. Orders. Also, I can't get a clear shot at this guy. <laughs> okay. Let's see if Behemoth can aim. Um without overheating like crazy. Got it. Nope, they they all can't aim. They're they are all they're all stupid. <sighs> I'm this close to losing valuable stuff on trying to capture this thing because my guys just roll shit rolls twenty four seven. Waiting for orders. I can't tell you how annoying that is. What's the what's the chance to hit this? Hello. Eighteen percent still. Okay, let's try again. Hallelujah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh shit, Jägermeck. Oh fuck, Banshee. Oh shit. Whoa, we're so lucky. That was close. Okay. Glitch, you need to really, really topple this guy. Actually, we do have coolant vampire. fur. Let's go ahead and topple this guy. Right, oh, we can't topple him, we just get him unsteady. So, TTB, don't have cool shot yet, but that's okay. We'll just go over the rise here. And say, yo, Jägermeck. How's it going, buddy? That will be a shutdown, unfortunately, so I can just shoot one. That's alright. One might be all I need. <laughs> nope. Good to go. 
Okay, Behemoth, you need to be you need to be gone. Honestly, like this is just too dangerous. Um. Yeah, we'll just splinter over here. Should not be in sight. Out of sight, out of mind, hopefully. Yep, trench bucket going for the Orion, that's good. Orion still has some armor left. Not much, but a little bit. I'm a pounding, Commander. Standing by. Decker, still overheated and also not looking very healthy on the right torso. <sighs> Can I move in a way where I can shoot him properly? Nope. What I can do is move over here. Hang on, not both here, here. And shoot to the left side. But be partially exposed in the back. Actually, that's the right side, what am I talking about? <laughs> is there no... I would have to be down here to be able to properly engage these guys. Oh dear. Well... Let's see that Jäger mech. Ah, it's also still very healthy. The trench bucket could topple over though with the ace-20 shot. So... On it. Let's topple him. Well, we destroyed the right torso. Most of his weapons and he's falling down and <laughs> there goes his arm and his torso. That was a good shot. Okay. Commander? Glitch. Would you do the honors of shaking the Jäger a little bit? Maybe even get a side torso? Very nice. And it's also dropping. Right? No? Okay. Unsteady just. Where are you going, dude? Okay, it's not even shooting. Perfect. Well, that is a signal for TTB to do cool and vent. Alright, dude. You're about to face the full power of this fully operational battle station. Well, not the full power, let's see. One small laser less. Okay, two small lasers less. It does not matter. RIP! He's still alive. Barely, but he's still alive. Okay, well, Behemoth. Um, Behemoth can move into a spot where she can get a shot on this guy. So that's exactly what we'll do. If cool and vent. Go on the trench bucket. The Full medium laser salvo. Rip! Last guy left. Last guy. Holy hell. Uh oh. You. Mother fudger. This AI is so annoying. Like that they don't. Like there's no. Like give up mechanic or anything in the AI. No, no. They will just keep coming for your, your damaged mechs. That is, that is the most annoying thing ever. Close range interface learning. Good to go. Followed by got it. some AC20 massage. Only got two rounds left here. <laughs> Actually, let's shoot the big ones. All right. Confirmed. Finally. Woo. That was a big one, guys. That was a big one, guys. And that means some repair time. Yeah. Like these missions with like big amounts of um, backup. I mean, this was a main lance, a heavy main lance with an assault plus mediums plus uh, heavies as backup. Uh, Glitch will be injured for 12 days, that's alright. Um, luckily, we, don't, we didn't lose any components. Let's hope for some good salvage. And that is good salvage. <laughs> Three missile slots! Highlander 733P! <laughs> oh, that was nice. What can, what can we get here? Learn 20 plus with, with 2 damage plus. That would be nice to get. Anything else in here that is nice to have? Whoa. That would be amazing. If we get that, that would be amazing. But I, will, I want the mech first before I want this thing. So let's see if we can get it. We get the Lurum. Didn't get a targeting computer, unfortunately. But we got the Highlander. And that is, ladies and gentlemen, what we came for. 
Uh, if I get two more Highlanders, I can name myself the North Wind Highlanders, laddie. Beautiful. Very nice. So now that we have that Highlander, we can make that our learn platform of choice, and Glitch will be sitting even prettier. Um, yeah, and they want to get upgraded. Okay. All right. So let's check out MacWarriors first real quick. Uh, Behemoth, how are you doing? Um, hmm. Call shot mastery, perfect. Training complete. Decker. Plus two unsteady threshold. Yes, please. Mech warrior training complete. Glitch. Hmm. Hmm. No, that doesn't do anything for us. So more piloting. Confirm. And then TTB. Plus unsteady threshold. Or indirect fire penalty. Hmm. Unsteady threshold. Okay, so now that's done. Now we go to the mech base. <laughs> First thing we need to do is repair everything. Okay. Now we can start working on that Highlander. Have a look at that. I'm gonna strip it completely. Okay, so we got... That is nice. Oh, guys. Ah! Oh, mmm! Ah! Oh, yep. Okay. First of all, strip all equipment. Confirm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Confirm. Now we can refit this thing. <laughs> first things first. We have an assault mech, we need armor. Big, juicy amounts of armor. Now, unfortunately, this model cannot carry a AC-20. But other than that, it should be fine. Okay, let's see. Can we, can we shave some more armor off, maybe off the back here? Uh-huh. Actually, maybe not. We'll, we'll see. For now, um, let's get the weaponry in. So, we would take... Lerm 20s, of course, because this thing can actually carry three Lerm 20s. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Look at that juice. Okay. I'm just, I'm just trying to see how it, how it all fits in right now, guys. No, no worries. Then we would have um, potentially six tons of ammo, I would say. That should be enough. Four... Five, six tons of ammo, and then we have we have three point defense weapons, right? So I would probably go for small lasers then. Add three small lasers, and the rest would just be heat sinks. And I know, I know, guys, I know that I have double heat sinks here. I'm just scared to use them because you never get them back if you lose them. Like you can't you can't buy them or you just yeah, you need to be very lucky to be able to buy them. Okay, so that would basically be it then. Wow. <laughs> Could even put a gyro in there. Yep, this is looking good, guys. Looking good, guys. Uh, reset. We need to strip the onion. Well, not all, not everything from the onion, but the. We need to strip the Lerm 20. And the double heat sink. Okay. I can I can just add a normal Lerm 20 to that, right? I do have several of those, yep. So we'll just add a normal Lerm 20. And a normal heat sink. And this mech will basically be operational again. Confirm. And then we should be able to build this thing now. Aha, I love mech construction. It's almost, it's almost as fun building these things than using them later on. I just I just wish I had more of stability damage, that would be amazing. So, Lerm 20, Lerm 20, Lerm 60 now. Guys, this is gonna hit like a truck.
I mean, of course, you could also turn this into a brutal close-range fighter with, like, um... SRMs, and then, I don't know, medium lasers or whatnot, but, nah. Nah, 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 nah. I like myself a learn boat. I might actually consider doing a double heatsink in here. I'm just, I'm, I'm just, honestly, guys, I am really scared to use him. Put a gyro in here. Put heat sinks in here. Okay, time for ammo. Time for ammo. Is that six tons of ammo, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Then now we need to lose a little bit of armor. I can actually get the whole back to 55 armor. So good. I actually forgot something. Hey, hey, I forgot my lasers. Um, how do we do this? It's three slots, right? Yep. Yeah. I think it should be heat efficient enough, actually. So we can remove, I'd say, one heatsink here. And then we add... Bop, 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 where are they? Because I very rarely get in the range where, where I can actually use these anyways. Add two small lasers here. Because they won't, won't be used all the time, right? And I would like to have a third one, but... would have to lower armor somewhere. I, could, I guess I could lower the armor on this armor a little bit for that. But do I really want to? Because it's a nice tanking side here, it's a nice shield side on the right. I don't think it's worth it. Let's keep it like that. Confirm. Alright guys, that concludes today's episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. Drop me a like, tell your friends about this series, and hopefully we can get more people to view it. Thanks for watching, this has been TTB, wherever you are on this planet. Have a great day, take care.